Yo, what's going on guys? It's Mickey CTX. How you fuckers doing today? Hopefully you guys are doing splendid like a Splenda on a fucking tea or maybe coffee. So whatever you guys want to be. Hopefully you guys are having a good Christmas because today is fucking Christmas and if you've been a bad fucker Santa, I'm going to come give you your little spanking dessert that you wanted for the whole year. So anyways, going back to this whole YouTube commentary. Thank you guys for stopping by. I appreciate you guys when you stop on by. But let's go ahead and talk about this whole concept that, that you see here in the title. Very simple. If you don't know what video you're watching, the fuck I'm going to be talking about, you might want to look above you right there above the video. So that's what I'm going to talk about. Hot sexy freaks are the way to go. Fuck yeah, dudes. Have you guys, like, I don't know. You guys ever dated a girl that's just boring and bad or just boring, period. And there's no real purpose of even really fucking her or just having a good time with her. So, um, yeah, that's the way to go. I always encourage all my bros and my and my freaking girlfriends, girls and girls and girls and guys and guys. Uh, yeah, I tell them, look, you're going to date. You better make sure that that person you're dating is going to be a freak the way to go trust me you don't want to be stuck around with one girl that just does the same shit over and over and over again like submissionary position man even doggy style just gets boring after the same things over i mean if you do the same thing over and over i mean yeah sex is great dude like pizza pizza is amazing i love a motherfucking good slice of pizza here and there but i can't have the same slice of pizza every damn day with the same amount of toppings and the same amount of slices you know that, sh that shit gets gross after maybe the third fourth day it gets pretty fucking boring if you ask me so what do you do in order for you to kind of have a good solution for this whole problem if you can't find a freak first things first you gotta be a freak yourself so if you're not a freak you can't expect your other person that you're with to be a freak of course it could always be improved by you just doing more experiments second of all the second thing I mean you could do is well you gotta experiment once you experiment more and not, not be so scared like oh I'm so insecure about my body I don't want to try this because you know I, I I was here when I was I uh, did this once with my boyfriend and he didn't like it so I'm traumatized that means every guy is gonna be the same way no fuck that shit I hope you guys enjoyed my voice of a uh, mimicking the same girl because I'm pretty sexy as a bitch aren't I okay <laughs> but anyways so hopefully you guys <laughs> you guys experiment after not experimenting it's important like how the fuck do you become a scientist if you don't use these experiments so yeah same thing thick you gotta experiment third thing you gotta do of course is you gotta ask for advice you're at the right fucking channel you're you really are you hit the jackpot when you hit this channel so you gotta you got any questions you could always email me now i'm not gonna get into this pedophilia type of fucking questions you know i'm not gonna encourage like little 12 year olds to do with it you know what our grown men are doing but if you're old enough you know i, I will ask how old you are and hopefully you're not gonna lie but I could always make a video about it and just make it into a generalization. So if you guys don't get advice, you're never going to learn. So you got to kind of just try different things. Ask your friends, hey, man, you ever done this, man? You know, because you, you ever sucked a girl's toe? <laughs> I, I, I don't know. It, it comes to vary. It's just a lot of things you could, you could ask. So this is what I'm saying. If you guys don't date a freak, date one. It's going to change your mind of everything forever. It's the best way to go. Girls dress better when they're about to have some sex. It's just amazing even after they're done and while and before. So take it from me. Make it CTX. I approve this message. So yeah. I appreciate you guys all stopping by. Love it when you guys stop by. Hit that like button. It helps me out so much. Of course, it helps my channel out. Love it when you guys hit that like button and subscribe if you're not. Of course, you haven't already. And uh, yeah. But the question of the day today is going to be on a rate of 1 to 10. What's the freakiest girl you have ever dated? top the scale let me know and don't try to lie so till next time this is yours truly mickey ctx and i'm out cool sign